Welcome to the video on common ways to list your products on Amazon. Let us first learn about the commonly used terms that you will notice while listing your products. Every product offered for sale on Amazon gets an automatically generated Amazon Standard Identification Number and multiple sellers may offer the same ASIN. SKU Stock Keeping Unit is a unique identifier provided by you to recognize the product listed. Product ID They are part of a system of unique identifiers called GTINs or Global Trade Item Numbers. The most common GTINs used to create Amazon catalog pages are Universal Product Codes UPCs, International Standard Book Numbers ISBNs, European Article Numbers EANs, and Japanese Article Numbers JAMs. The listing method you select depends on two factors. 1. Whether your product already exists on Amazon or if you have to create a new listing and 2. Whether you are adding product one by one or in bulk. The Amazon catalogue features products sold by many sellers. To prevent the same product from appearing multiple times, Amazon asks sellers to eliminate duplicate listings by matching the exact same listing. If you're selling a product that is already listed on Amazon, you will create an offer using the existing product detail page. This process is called matching to an existing listing. If you want to match to an existing listing one by one, use the Add a Product tool. On the Seller Central homepage, hover over the Inventory tab and click on the Add a Product option. Make sure you are matching to the exact same product. Enter a product identifier like a UPC, ASIN or ISBN number into the search box to get accurate results. If you don't have a product identifier, search for the product by entering key details like brand name with a unique identifier like a part or model number. Once you find the listing, review the title, brand name, images, key product features, description and additional information on the detail page to ensure the match is correct. Just because you are selling something similar does not mean it is the same. If the search result exactly matches your product, click on the Sell this product button. Next, you will be prompted to enter the condition of the product, price, quantity available and the fulfillment channel. If you are a professional seller and want to match to an existing listings in bulk, use the inventory loader. Hover over the inventory tab and click on add products via upload. Scroll down to the bottom of the page, expand the inventory files section and download the inventory loader. This spreadsheet will allow you to quickly upload thousands of products which already exist in Amazon Catalog. Now let's learn when to create a new listing. New listings are required when 1. You are sourcing or creating your own branded products. 2. You are selling private label products. Or 3. You are trying to list a product that is not present in Amazon's catalog. The creation of the detail page depends on how many items you want to list at one time. If your product does not appear in your search results, click on I'm adding a product not sold on Amazon. Choose the product category. Choosing the best category ensures that you see the most appropriate data fields for your product. After you click on Select Category, you will be redirected to a listing page. You can start entering product details here. It is best to enable advanced view so that you can see which fields are required and which are optional. We recommend you to update all critical details that might be optional, which will help in product discoverability and provide important information to your customers. You are required to fill all the mandatory fields highlighted in red in each tab. Under Vital Info, enter information like item title, manufacturer, product ID, brand name, part number, etc. Under Variation tab, enter details if the product that you are selling is available in different sizes, color, package, quantity, etc. Under Offer tab, 
provide information like price, quantity, condition, fulfillment channel, etc. Add product compliance information under Compliance tab. Under the Images tab, you can add the main as well as alternate images of your product. Refer to the image guidelines of your product category before uploading. Next, add descriptions, keywords and any additional details in the More Details section. Once you have entered all the information, click on Save and Finish. If you are a professional seller and want to upload new products in bulk, hover over the Inventory tab and click on Add Products via Upload. Expand the Inventory Files section and download the category-specific inventory files. This spreadsheet allows you to upload and update new listings on Amazon. That wraps up the product listings overview video. Thank you and happy selling!